Hey, this is Bray with Pontier Deckbow Magazine. We're in Georgia this week, here with uh, Rick from Premier, and uh, we're at a very unusual event. Uh, you've been working with your dealer, uh, David, here, and he put on this uh, idea, put it on this event, to get identical boats together and uh, to test them to figure out which horsepower works in different situations, right? So how, how did you guys get involved, and, and uh, when did he first pitch this idea to you? Sure, we were down here, uh... It was the first or second week of August, and we spent uh, some time with them, um, with some other dealers down here. Started talking about the value of being able to demonstrate how our boats perform and being able to compare motor manufacturer to motor manufacturer to get an apples to apples comparison. And uh, it all came to me. What a, what a great event! And uh, obviously, uh, as a manufacturer, dealers are extremely important to, to your, your business. So, how how has Carefree Boats and Dave especially been good for you guys? David's a great partner with us. You know, he does a great job here, runs a great dealership. He's about serving our customers well, which is obviously important to us. How did you guys decide which specific uh, Premier Pontoon you want to use? You know, uh, we looked at uh, what we felt was uh, was kind of that, that sweet spot for the 250s and 300s. And, and uh, given the way horsepower is going and given the performance that we see in our uh, and our boats, we wanted an opportunity to really showcase what it is that, that these that these motors can do in the back of the boats. So. Uh, well, I'm uh, appreciative of the invite. It was fun coming down here. It's uh, been a little chilly this week, but uh, it's kind of fun seeing what we had 16 of your boats out on the water. Yeah, we had 16 boats on the water, and you know it was great to have each of the motor manufacturers represented here and, and their willingness to be here your willingness to be here and of course David's willingness to host all of us. All right, so I finally uh, caught up with David here. He's uh, with Carefree Bow Cells. He's the uh, the mastermind behind this. So how long have you been planning a uh, type of event like this? It took us about five months from beginning to end to kind of conceive all of it, put it together. It took a lot of support from Premier and all the individual motor guys and sold us props, which they brought it. several folks down, bought a lot of props for us to test out different configurations. So you ordered eight identical boats, you know, different colors and whatnot to, to get started. So um, how was that process? Like, how did you decide, like, for, for instance, which model you want to start with with Premier? For Premier, we look at it from what's the most popular boat going these days, and it's some sort of boat that has the rear bay configuration. The other thing we saw is that every time we looked at a magazine or we get calls from customers, the boats are always different, and the motors are always different, and the props are always different. So we wanted to hold the constant of the exact same model, only changing the motor, and then within that, trying different prop variations. Go over some of the, the things you wanted to specifically test that we were able to get accomplished. We get calls from customers on a daily basis, asking us, what's the difference between the 250 and the 300, the 3 to 350? What's the difference between a Merc, a Yamaha, a Suzuki, a Honda? And we just don't answer the questions about top speed, and we talk about fuel economy, we talk about tubing performance or water sports performance, which is, that's really that zero to 20, zero to 30 metric. And then we talk about cost. We tell all the customers, every boat here will go 40. You wanna go 45, we can make that happen. It's an equation of money and fuel burn. You wanna go 50, we can make that happen. More money, more fuel. So we try to understand the customer's needs, but with this data, we wanted to scientifically give them all the answers. We ran the boats, we did our 0 to 20, 0 to 30, fully loaded them, we even ran an obstacle course. What did you get from all this? Probably one of the visit, biggest takeaways on this was the very last test we did, where we put them at the max capacities. We put 12 adults on. We had already done the comparison earlier on with six adults, and all the baseline testing at two. And to see how those performance dramatically changed across each motor differently than expected. We couldn't have done it without Premier. They got us the boats early. Uh, we got them ready and we started on. That's great. Uh, yeah, it's been a lot of fun. I appreciate the invite. Uh, I know I've learned a lot and it's, uh, now it's time to compile all that uh, data and get, this, uh, get the word out. So That's our number one goal is the, uh, the numbers speak for themselves. There you go.